Live from a little corner of Austin, where it's totally Founders Week season. Wait, no one's watching. <laughs> it, is the internet down? <laughs> it's going to be a great night. Now, before my boobs are completely dry, here are your hosts, Brian Brushwood and Justin Robert Young! <laughs> All right, all right. We've been coy about it. Yeah, fuck let's, it. Let no. Let's let, let it loose. <laughs> We're I mean, cutting it loose. <laughs> you get you, a knife. We're cutting it loose. You notice. Rah! I notice. Let's do it. Everyone in the room notices. Everyone notice. notices. Notice. We're noticing. I'm the only one brave enough to call it. Call it. You're a little taller, aren't you? Me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Was that what you're calling? You them? got a little taller when I wasn't looking. Like you used to be more like, <laughs> what? more what? like, <laughs> and now you're all like, <laughs> come on. You think I got <laughs> taller? Yeah, we all we've all been talking about it. <laughs> Everybody's been saying it. I mean, me. <laughs> End of list. Yeah. We're all talking about it. <laughs> What's your secret? <laughs> True story. <laughs> so uh, uh, I'm watching TV, and all of a sudden I see a commercial, and it's for Vans. Oh. And it's the entire thing is about, like, do you need back support? Do you need, are you old as shit and your fucking back is crumbling and you need back support and you buy insoles for back support? Well, buy these shoes because these shoes will give you back support. And I'm like, fuck, how far has Vans fallen off, man? When fucking I was growing up, Vans was the coolest shit. They had their own tour where all the punk bands played, all the skateboarders used them. So anyway, these are Vans shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Because oh my god! They were marketing exactly. <laughs> I didn't know. I just thought I was like, "What's a funny thing?" I don't know. Just say he's taller, and then just have him insist he's not. Then keep insisting he's taller. Yeah. And then I mean, no, no, no. This adds nothing to my height. Okay. But I am old. <laughs> right. But I am old, and I do have a bad bag. And I was immediately like, "I don't know. Those vans look pretty cool." <laughs> okay, we've been coy about it, but you know, I guess we should announce that this episode is brought to you by Vans and their new yeah. initiative, <laughs> Old People's Shoes. In uh, Guess Souls what? For you used to yes. <laughs> when you are at your computer talking <laughs> about how much you don't have sex, that's right. Uh, uh, carpal tunnel begins in the toes. It begins in the heart. You need, technically, yeah, well, it begins in the heart. <laughs> it circulates <laughs> through the soles and then echoes through the fingers and the internet at large. Your pain can be solved by vans. NASA will deny all of this is true. Yep. And that's why you know we are right. Yes. <laughs> Call NASA right now. 1-900-NASA-NOS. <laughs> it's a 900 and number? <laughs> they're going to tell you straight to your face that you're a fucking liar. And I'm and telling you, you're right. What are they lying about? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Bryce, do we have a story? <laughs> Justin's got a gift. Oh, it's a, a subtitle, not a gun, probably. Probably. Uh, by, uh, by the way, I know nothing about what's about to happen ex outside of Justin said, hey, so anyway, uh, pre-production meeting. I have a Why is he giving that voice? Right? Because it's, 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 it's the way. It's me, Justin. That's how he imagines everyone who's taller than him sounds like. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> I, I thought I'd get a little bit taller and then I'll no, give Brian like a this. gift. Hey. But it'll be a sincere gift and it'll be weird. Don't make jokes about insoles or incels beforehand. And then just Don't now I'm like, I'm Fuck! It, is, it is a sincere gift. So this does begin Founders Week. Yes. Uh, this has been planned for over two years, right? Because it was supposed to happen two years ago. That's right. It got, uh, uh, we, we did our opening ceremonies uh, in uh, uh, 2019, uh, 2019. Uh, and uh, it was important that it be on this day so that the fifth anniversary be during the eclipse and all that stuff. And then it's like, okay, that was a private event. Now we're going to open it up to founders and all that stuff. And then uh, the world kicked us in the nuts. Yeah. And I remember you saying, Ryan, have you considered 
not hosting a super spreader event? <laughs> and I was like, oh, well, as if. And you're like, Ryan, <laughs> I'm serious. Maybe we should. Some, someday I'll be very tall and you'll believe me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I feel like this audience has actually maybe the best uh, uh, a relationship with this process because you have talked about you know, from searching for properties to this being on the menu, to this being off the menu, to you buying it, to all like you know, moving in, like, like even like, you know, modern rogue shoot, like even while you, this, you own this, you were still shooting in other places and everything, but this then night attack now great night has followed it. And it was a event that we held a, a night attack event that was out here before the pandemic. Yeah. Where for a VIP, event we brought everybody out oh here. you motherfucker we brought everybody out here and this was your demoing of this property uh and you I brought everybody know through what this it is. i know what this is and you you fucking you fucking fucking short piece of shit you'll never be tall <laughs> fuck you <laughs> and out where literally the sound stage stands now uh, which people who come out here will will uh, begin the ceremonies out there uh, was being demolished. It was l like trees were being uh, 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 brought out. So a <laughs> there was definitely a moment that is like, please pay a hundred dollars plus for our VIP event in which construction will be happening behind me <laughs> <laughs> and trees will be demolished. Exactly. As I wave my hands and you walk around an abandoned uh, property. <laughs> That is one way to say it. <laughs> the other way to say it is that that exact moment was Brian's wall. God Disney damn it, pose. I knew it! Oh, fuck. And so that I've I've got that is my gift to Brian wow. oh. on uh, uh, Founders Day. Is is this what will eventually be a statue here on <laughs> on on property? We just have to come up with like a pervy mouse mascot or something. Uh, my pervy? Why not? <laughs> That's uh, a good first name. John Burby. <laughs> yeah. Burby Mouse. So there we go. Oh my Brian, God. It'll be uh, Burby uh, Happy, ha happy Founders Day. Long delayed. Holy shit. Yeah. But uh, wow. uh, uh, well, well deserved. Everybody, let's get a round yeah. of applause. Yeah. It gets a good place. Not one of them bullshit places for, yeah. for things. That gets a good place here. All right. So I was taking a dump the other day. <laughs> <laughs> Bryce, next topic. All right. Brett's bidet bounty. <laughs> As if I predicted it. <laughs> we it this is why this show can't have nice things. I was wondering whether or not I should do it in the pre-show. Uh, no, now. this is this And I was is like, perfect. no, it's better that it's during the show because it has more consequence. I but said course, bidet, we're sir. us, because we're us, it has to then follow uh, 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 or get followed by an asshole story. Yes, an asshole story. This That was an asshole, and then here's an asshole. Yeah, we started there with an go. asshole. So, uh, God, man, there's just no way to put this, and I know he's not watching. So my 83-year-old father is uh, visiting me right now Yeah, uh, from Mexico, and uh, uh, we've had a very interesting week because, you know, as you know, uh, older people that who live alone have yeah. different – habits than the rest of us comfortable yeah. they, they've carved He's out uh, they've carved out the perfect butt groove of life in that easy chair My and dad i don't blame them one bit yeah. for not wanting to get up and have somebody else fuck up their perfect ass groove My dad back to the ass. exactly is. i don't know my father's not in my life but go ahead <laughs> so, <laughs> so uh yesterday yeah uh, he he we I'm, I'm making dinner and he says I just realized what that thing is in the bathroom. And I'm like, what are you talking about? And he said, the thing on the, the toilet. Sink. The, yeah, the sink. <laughs> it's not a urinal. No. <laughs> so uh, he said, he said, there's a, the, the thing with the, the, there's the knob where you sit down. I'm like, oh, so the, the water, the, the Japanese water thing that the toilet seat. He goes, yeah. And he's like, that thing is really that's a that's a revelation. All right, that's going on. Press pause. Yeah, okay. and also I, can, uh, uh, let me also while you press pause, mm -hmm. I'm just gonna set a note to myself. When I'm 83, do heroin for the first time. Yeah, <laughs> it seems like everything's more magical when you do Absolutely. it for the first time at 83. Absolutely. Go ahead. I, I I don't know where the rest of the tale goes, uh, but at, as he's telling you this, how certain are you 
that you're both talking about the same experience. I, I, I am certain. But as an added note, my father is a minister. He, is, he does prison ministry in Mexico. He is very devout. He does the whole thing. And so the reason why he's not here that's, tonight. That's the most hardcore ministry. Yep. Like like every every uh, <laughs> like, every, hey. every every qualifier makes it more hardcore. Yeah. Knock knock knock. Excuse me. Hi hi. Uh, uh, my name is Brian. I'd like to be a minister. I'd like to evangelize the faith that we all believe in. Yeah. Uh, hi, uh, hi, I, we, I, run, I run all ministries. Okay. Listen. Um, <laughs> yeah. I want a minister. Sure. Let's. let's Everybody let's, does, my guy. Let's what start do off with. Say, I don't know. What do you got that's really easy? Something really easy. Oh, you know, yeah. there's uh, uh there's one uh, uh town. Everybody's made of marshmallows. Okay. All right. It's and called then what Candyland. I... You bring the word of God. <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. Come drop fantasies. You want that? Uh, what happens when you baptize people in Candyland? <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think there's an opening? <laughs> Maybe you know, maybe something a little bit more advanced. What else you got? All right. Well, there's a town where uh, everybody smiles. It's uh, uh, the last thirty seconds of the black hole sun video uh, where they I, shot that. I, I don't want to. Only go to... '90s kids will understand. <laughs> right. Uh, uh, I got that reference. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I appreciate there the offer, go. but I would never go to Utah. What else you got? Uh, uh, well. I mean, of the current listings? Yeah, hardest, hardest. I, I am feeling up so to the So you don't challenge. want easy, now yeah. you want hard. I mean, now that I've heard what easy is, they sound yeah. like a nightmare. <laughs> well, I mean, you can Especially minister that in beautiful snow-capped mountains of Utah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but the faces. Yeah, they <laughs> smile weirdly. <laughs> okay. It's weird. Let's move on. Black hole sun. <laughs> yeah, no, all right. Black, Black hole sun. I'm with, I'm yeah. with you. Okay. <laughs> like and then they smile weird. I want to go where there's cartels trying to kill me and preach the word of God. Well, I'll give you the MS-19 special and make you <laughs> minister in Mexico. Ba -ba -ba -da. Ba -ba -ba -da. I didn't pick that. I just said Which it was the right sound, and oh, that's I, what right, it played. Price, price. Was that for our joke, The Price is Right, or Mexico? <laughs> the Price is Right. Oh, okay. All right. The correct answer was MS-19. Shit. Yeah. God damn it. Isn't it MS-13? Damn it. Is it 13 or 19? 19. Uh, 13. 13? It's 13. I don't know. I haven't seen it since Fast 6. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I feel like this is. Uh, is is there more to the tale? There is more yes. to the tale. Tale, so, yes. <laughs> no, our long digression <laughs> is not the entire story. So the 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 great thing is is that my dad is you. He's I, we have to be careful of the words that we say each, to each other because that's why he's not here. I knew that he would not enjoy himself here because it would be too too much. I I, I was not a. You, I I think I remember you saying that he was a minister. Yes. I didn't know he was. That, that kind, kind of, of minister. minister. Right. So yeah, I understand now. So I mean, and I told him, "Don't come, don't come tonight. There's just, just stay home." He said, so, "You're not welcome." No, never darken the doorstep no. of the Seven Acres Wood. It's just not your thing. That's right. Uh, yeah, but but sometimes darkness shows up in my dad. Uh oh. And uh -oh. this time he was telling me, like, "Wow, that thing's a re revelation." And I was like, "Cool." And he's like, "Yeah," because you know, my wife uh, it was complaining. I'm like, "Okay." You know, because with this, I don't have to like change my. And he goes for it, and I'm like, "Are change, we gonna do?" Change, and I, change your what? His underwear. His life. Because I'm like, "Oh, are we gonna?" And I said, "Are we gonna do this?" And he's like, "What do you mean?" I mean, are we talking about racing stripes? Is that is that what we're talking about? And he continued further than I was comfortable with, <laughs> and. Explaining what an eighty-three-year-old butt has to deal with, and you instead of using this thing and, and go on, <laughs> <laughs> like all of a sudden we're pulling up chairs. There's a campfire, <laughs> <laughs> and he was like, "How different is it than your butt?" He goes, "It gets really crusty down there." Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. There you go. That's exactly. And I'm fifty-five. That boy. would be a dad, revelation. No, Dad. No. So, and it, and then I'm like, EK is right there. She's gonna look at you and then look at me and go, "That's what I'm gonna have to deal with." And I'm like, "Stop this conversation right now!" And my dad actually 
got me to like, you know, I can go with jokes. He actually I went do far, know you he can went go far with jokes. after I'm like, I'm, I'm you no tapped out. So what, you tapped out. Tapped what, out. What, I mean, look, I think we're hearing you loud and he clear. He dark you. Yeah. Th- there's, there's somebody better at Great Night than we are. <laughs> Let me give him a call. <laughs> no! I mean, so you're buying him a bidet. Yes. Yes. And that that's, the, that's the other funny part is that, you know, we're trying that to. Was, the, I bet you that was the end goal. Yes. That's an old Mexican prison trick to get somebody to buy you a bidet. Exactly the right thing. <laughs> all, like, uh, all we're oh, worried man. about is getting it into his uh, uh, into his luggage so he can get it across so he the can... border. <laughs> Jeez, it's not God. contraband. It's a He's, water so, fixture. I mean, my suggestion is he shoves it up his ass and gets it across the corner. Oh, you're, you're just... I mean, after you've heard what goes on there, yeah, dude. No. Good. And now there's going to be crust all over it. <laughs> Bryce, next topic. <laughs> Moonshite. Stinky. Man, fuck this show. Fuck that show. <laughs> fuck Moon Knight. <laughs> Truly fuck Moon Knight. Oh, shit. I've normally, never had, nor, uh, normally we have weird uh, <laughs> elongated conversations about MCU Disney Plus shows on our, on our Patreon. <laughs> Uh, but but uh, yeah, Bryce this is, is so hot. fired can't wait. up about can't Moon Knight, wait. which I have not seen. You've seen? Uh, yeah. Okay. And you've I've seen, seen it. Yeah. You guys liked it. Uh, yeah. b- before Bryce uh, uh, unleashes, <laughs> um, I found it rather cute. Yes. Uh, uh, I didn't care for Hawkeye at the beginning, but by the end, I thought it was quite good. So <laughs> however good this was, uh, I Hawkeye's figured... own series at the beginning. Yeah. Hawkeye isn't. No, in he's saying night. that Hawkeye should. Yeah. No, no, I meant the show. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha, correct. Gotcha, gotcha. Correct. Okay. Uh, what I'm saying is there is a precedent for starting off slow and becoming quite good. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so, so I, I don't know. I'm in. It seemed, yeah. it seemed fine. Ladies uh, and gentlemen, <clears throat> Bryce. Yeah. It is like, insulting the way this show is written it is it, it, well i mean it's it's it like let him go. I, I mean let may, him, maybe Brian, it was too Brian, complicated for let him. him go no go. it's the exact opposite oh. there, there is no <laughs> god damn it you got me <laughs> <laughs> I, n- I know that full the- screen, full screen yourself. Spotlights on you. <laughs> yeah, I know that the superhero stuff is four quadrant. It's got to be for everybody. We can't just run ahead. Yep. Old, but- young, for- British, uh, uh, British, Irish, dude, Scottish, Scottish. Yeah. Mother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my, oh just, my mother. It. 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 It is. What was your favorite part? Stop stopping yourself. <laughs> talk some shit, man. You were talking some shit on Twitter. It is. You're giving that shit away on Twitter. That's this right. is where the money's made, motherfucker. <laughs> look, okay. Patreon.com slash. Oh, I almost said the other show. Oh, oh. <laughs> great night. <laughs> I had almost made a few mistakes earlier. <laughs> it's 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 very slow. It takes a very long time to do anything and. Stephen Moon Knight or whatever his name is doesn't <laughs> seem to act like a human being who has a problem that he's trying to solve. He Why? Just act, because, okay. Did, did you like the part where they just loudly burst in and said, anyway, this is the plot of the show. <laughs> yeah, and then just it, in case you missed it, they said it again. <laughs> That's, that was the thing. It took 40, it's 43 minutes. The, the show is 43 minutes. I know because that's when I I looked at the time to realize when they set up the fucking conflict of the show. No, they don't even do that. They don't even set up the conflict. They just say, oh, yeah, you like Sleepwalk or some shit. I don't know. That's your first episode. Cool. So so that way, if you were recapping the episode, yeah, recap the entire episode right now. Oh. Go. Okay. Dr. Stephen Moon Knight, he has a problem sleeping, right? He, uh, he, he... Uh, sets incredibly easy to to replace traps in his bedroom, like masking tape. He used painter's tape to cover up his door. Too specific. Move. Sorry. Anyway. <laughs> and then uh, he's like, "Oh, I'm I'm, I'm like a cashier." At Use the, the accent. Store. I couldn't possibly. Please try. <laughs> oh, You've only got thirty seconds to be funny. <laughs> oh, I'm at the gift shop and I don't want to be doing that, mate. <laughs> No, no, finally, keep the idiot going, got keep it. Keep going, keep going. Do the rest of the recap in that voice. <laughs> no, keep going, keep no, going. No, keep, no, going. Go. keep going, keep going. You got this. Uh, 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 oh, I don't, I don't want to be a cashier. I want to be the museum guy. <laughs> and then, like, 20 minutes of nothing happening. And then he has, uh, uh, oh, I'm in a car 
fight. What am I in the Swiss Alps? <laughs> and then that's the end of episode one. Because fucking nothing happens other than like an okay yeah, action scene. How about that Sounds moment? Like he goes to the Swiss Alps. It, 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 uh, uh, how about that moment where he misses a date, goes to the restaurant, looks at his smartphone, and <laughs> says, "Well, I mean, it's clearly Friday." Are and you? Then and then people he take turns someone. telling him it's Sunday. <laughs> And then he uses his smartphone that presumably has the date on it to call his date to say, why aren't you here? And she says, because it's Sunday. It was Tuesday. And he's like, oh, isn't it? And then he asks the maybe, waiter maybe, again. Maybe he has an Android. <laughs> <laughs> Very, you know, their time is different yeah, over there. Yeah, it is. It's a poor people's phone. <laughs> Bryce, next know. topic! Brian's new dog. New, new dog. Yeah. Can't get enough of them new, new way, dogs. That now is a thing with Darren and I that I keep calling his phone a poor people's phone. That's pretty good. He has the new fold, which is way more expensive than any, <laughs> like most computers I've ever owned. Yeah. Uh, uh, but yeah. Anyway, go no, ahead. That, that, that is good. Um, hey, uh, I got a dog. Uh, you have two dogs. Uh, yeah. You know, I believe... It was the bard. <laughs> was it? Was it? Was it the streetwise troubadour? <laughs> yes, the streetwise troubadour Jim Jam once said, "Yo, what up? You <laughs> set up me, the preamble. Give, give me twenty dollars <laughs> or a dog." <laughs> and I asked him, "Why do you do that?" He says, "Because secretly, I just wish they'd give me more dogs." <laughs> I didn't that know you that. knew Jim Jam. Oh man, Jim Jam. <laughs> Me and him go way back. Oh, really? Where'd yeah. you meet? Dog college. Dog college? Dog yeah. college. Wait, is that a college? <laughs> like run by dogs? Well, I mean, we were professors to dogs. Oh, That's where we okay. fell in love with them. I bet you the poker games are legit. <laughs> <laughs> You know, we yeah, there was a brief uh, kerfluffle, a little bit yeah. of a controversy about one of them. Look, I don't want to get crass here, but the bitches, the dog pile. <laughs> what about Whoa, the bitches? They're oh, all they're under. <laughs> I mean, I'd say they're underage, but it's like something, something times seven. Yeah. Uh, the uh, uh, no. Uh, uh, so okay, somehow I, I think last week we talked about the failed attempt to get a dog. Yep. And then we flashed and then, and briefly then your, the your possibility. Of, Josie like went on a a. Uh, Inspector Gadget uh, uh, a journey, despite yep. the fact that it's her older sister named Penny, uh, uh, to find the <laughs> exact... Actually, that was part of why we named her Penny. <laughs> this is partly inspired by Inspector Gadget. Uh, uh, to find the best dog. Yep. She found the best dog. Yep. And then this weekend, you were going to go to the Regal breeders who were not, you know, Waco COVID harborers. <laughs> Truth ah, back. it's me! <laughs> <laughs> this this time, but storm's coming. Uh, uh, <laughs> but, but you, you got the, the dog and so the breeders were good. Oh my God. It, it, we, we got there and it, it was, uh, Bonnie's adorable whenever I'm driving because she is usually, you know, tending to kids or whatever, but will occasionally glance at the road and just assume that whatever is there, I've not seen until she sees it. And so in this case, we're pulling in and, uh, you know, a couple dogs run across and she's like, puppy. Like, like in a warning way. Yeah. Uh, but, but we get out and, and there's all these different breeds. Apparently, this place is so happy that other stray dogs just show up and look around and say, yeah, yeah. this will do. Yeah. There's this big, <laughs> like, like my TV's dog, uh, Great Pyrenees, comes yeah. up and he's just like, sup, bro? All right, look, you're going to grab me right here. He's like, you know what? I'm just going to sit on these feet. That way you won't yeah. go anywhere. Ah, we're besties. Yeah. Uh, uh, all just the dogs go ahead, throw over your left leg, and I'll carry you to where you need to go. That's yeah. right. Clop, right. clop, 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 clop. Uh, so so we, we we get the dog, and, and, and uh, there's a male and a female that, that are available. Uh, uh, the males, you know, kind of raucous and running around. The female's a little bit more timid. Her ears are folded down, and, and I'm like, oh, is this one of those scaredy dogs? I don't know. Uh, but but she seems to warm to the children, and it's like, well, we're we're gonna go for it. But there was one brief moment that I didn't know it was an accident. I figured this was pure P.T. Barnum showmanship. They uh, truly accidentally let the gate open, and I saw seventeen of the happiest puppies I've ever seen in my entire life pouring out like a <laughs> river from this place. We're free, we're and free. my kids were just pause. <laughs> Who let the dogs out? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Fuck you. Appeal it. Appeal it to the Supreme Court. It's your fault Appeal for being... Appeal it to the Supreme Appeal Court. It. It's your fault for being so tall. Uh, the, uh, uh, <laughs> A lot, lot of happy dogs. Uh, and, and so uh, we end up taking the dog home. And, uh, like, I'm still like, it'll be fine. This is a fine. It's an Australian Shepherd. They're, they get along with wimes, all that stuff. Yeah. Uh, I'm mainly thinking about the logistics of introducing this dog to Joyful. Uh, but I'm also thinking, like, ah, do we get a scaredy dog or whatever? And then there's this brief moment. Mm, there's that moment you fall in love. You glance at the rearview mirror, and you, the beers are up, and the tongue's out like, ah, you know. And you're like, oh. And then, and so we're now, uh, two, two things are on our mind. What are we going to fight about calling her? Uh, and uh, how are we going to introduce her to Joy? Because Joy loves other dogs, loves to roughhouse with other dogs. Is a this puppy. is a smaller dog, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's, a yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. A, a, a four and a half month old puppy, right? Yeah. Uh, and so I am terrified because a bad introduction can uh, 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 scare the puppy, can yeah. mess up the puppy. It can mess up the relationship between the older dog and all that stuff. So I am on pins and needles as our year and a half old Weimar honor. How are we going to introduce her to this new who, puppy? Who, who even tonight we described as a mirth bulldozer. That's right. It's like Duff it, Man. <laughs> that's yeah. right. Duff Man. It's like the party's coming and there's no stopping it. Yeah. Uh, uh, so what we did is we in the backyard, we put the puppy in a kennel uh, and I took Joy out here to the property, ran her around a whole bunch and then came back. And then we went to the backyard and on Twitter, uh, I posted this Tension-filled moment, and I can't express this enough how terrified I am because uh, uh, having a dog get along with another dog is a big deal. And, and, I, have... I, and I'm glad that you are saying this yes. because it brings the context to this video that I don't think your Twitter words could really do justice to. Yes. Because let's watch the video. Oh, man. Sneakers. Oh, you think man. we can let her out? Like she's being... Oh. Aww. <laughs> okay, there you love Can we... Yep, I think we can. Okay. So for audio listeners, Joy is just Good sniffing girl. and laying and She's licking rolling over, and showing rolling belly. Over, and like... and uh, at one point, Bonnie says, come over here. And Joy goes, hey, fuck off. <laughs> and then sniffs this dog's yeah. butt. Uh, uh, they're getting along great. But now we have the great debate of what to call this thing. Okay. Penny wants it to be a dinosaur. She wants Velociraptor. I feel like you would need a like, like a, at least a shortened. It'd have to be like right. Velosa. Belly. Or, or or belly. Or yeah, yeah, rap, yeah. Rap, 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 rappy. rapper. Rap, 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 rap. They do. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever they get out, you're like, hey, everybody. You <laughs> heard the news? <laughs> my dog is missing and I am blue. Yeah. Please, somebody, find my dog. If you want to help, you can sing along. Velociraptor. <laughs> no, I was gonna go for like four oh. verses. That's fine. Um, we know. We know. <laughs> That's why he stopped. <laughs> I love that only Ali laughed at that. <laughs> the fucking Nutra Sweet Hill Gang. <laughs> Good title of the episode right there. <laughs> uh, but uh, 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 so there was a brief moment that I, I, with my heart on my sleeve, I said, you know what? I thought we were going to have a scared dog. And there was a moment. You know, we got Joyful, Federal Agent, Bryce, Doug, Nesh, Com Castillo, 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 Brushwood. Yeah, a perfect Joyful, name. Joy for short. Uh, there was a moment that I was really taken by, uh, by the fact that this dog that I thought would be scared turned out to be happy and thrilled to yep. come home with us. Like, what if we called her Bravery? It's kind of like the uh, girl's name, Avery, and we can call her Bravery. And there was a pause. And my 14-year-old 14, 14 said... Dad, uh, that's a little live, laugh, love white people for you. <laughs> <laughs> she when wasn't can, wrong. When can she host the show? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, points. that's good. Points. It's good. Yeah, yeah, no. It is a little uh, 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 eyes of the titties of the face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we, uh, we, haven't, we haven't settled, but we want to hear from all of chat realm. Have you considered titties? Uh, yeah. oh, have man. you considered titties? Just in general. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Titties! Right, right titties! Now, <laughs> right now, the top contenders. <laughs> I mean, I know it's a bit, but at a certain point, you're just screaming titties into titties! the mic. Titties! So you're just screaming titties. <laughs> That's what the uh, kids would do. <laughs> top contenders, yeah, are Goose. Oh, it's a fun name. Sure, yep. Like a if, dog named Goose, right? Yeah. If, whether if they're loose or if they've done something wrong, you're, it's always funny to say Goose. Um, she's got white 
fur on all of her paws. Mm -hmm. So boots yeah. or bootsy, which uh, I, 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 I made the kids listen to Groovus in the Heart so Thank they would understand who Bootsy Collins is. Um, that's what you had that to listen know. to for Bootsy <laughs> Collins? It's what I knew to tell Alexa to do. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, but uh, uh, more importantly, uh, Josie didn't like it because it sounded too much like booty. Um, and uh, uh, she does have mismatched eyes. Yeah. Penny, or sorry, Bonnie is a fan of Pippi because she loved Pippi Longstocking. Yep. Coming into your world. Yep. And, uh, and she's got like stockings on her feet. Like uh, Pippi yep. Longstockings. And yep. also, I get to call her Pip, like the Pip of a card, and she's got a diamond on her forehead. And fuck you, we're calling her Pip, kids. Sorry, I've decided. <laughs> End of the bit. Do not send in your emails. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to go through the, the, the Twitter thing. No, this is just an announcement. Uh, well, uh, no, no, it's, it's totally bing, up bing, for grabs. Bing, bing, Anybody, bing. all <laughs> ideas appreciated, as long as they agree that Pippi should be as the name. As long <laughs> as that, yeah, there is some play Nothing's on decided. Pippi. Nothing's decided. Nothing's decided. I get to say pip pip, which sounds like yip yip, which is what you say to flying bison. Yes. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Yep. Flying okay. bison. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This, yeah guy gets flying, this guy gets it. This guy gets it. Sky bison. Yeah, you're too tall. Yep. Like the animal? You don't no. get it. No, don't we're, get we're it. talking about Avatar the Last Airbender. Yeah, it was a random. Yep. What? Dude. There's like a big. <laughs> I, I see don't, you, don't. Jake Sully. <laughs> 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 like the blue people? Right. Yeah. No, that's right. He's got James exactly Cameron right. in the pool yep, with the sequel. Exactly yep, that's it. <laughs> Zoe Zaldana. <laughs> exactly it. What's her name? Sigourney Weaver. Sigourney sure. Weaver. Sure. How many people do I remember that in this movie? <laughs> <laughs> sure. uh, James Cameron. James Cameron. Yeah. <laughs> It's directed, Avatar The Last Airbender is directed by James Cameron. No. Yeah, sure. Uh, the cartoon Avatar. Sorry, I don't watch anime. Uh, oh, uh, God damn it. Yeah. <gasps> I do subs. Oh! oh! <laughs> Multifaceted bird. Uh, right, hey, next topic. Uh, oh, yeah, we got one more topic here. Founders Day week. Dude, we are in the mix. We are over the event horizon. Ain't no stopping this now. We have guests arriving. We have worm encrusted we people in the here. audience. Worm yeah. People. <laughs> uh, dude, it's, I, I'm so stoked. Um, uh, you, we were talking about this. I didn't even know what aspect of this to think and talk about, but you had pointed out like, yeah, it's maybe been a hot minute since we ground rules. Yeah, like ground rules. People ain't been to cons in a minute, right? They ain't been to cons in 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 a long time, I, I, and even the cons they've gone to have probably been yeah, mealy mouth versions of the things that they used to be. This is going to be the year, especially this summer, is going to be the year where things are full bore in the way that they used to be full bore. Yeah, and so since this is yours, your first, yep, big. Uh, 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 gathering, I feel like we should lay down what, like, the blessing. <clears throat> uh, ground rules to anybody who's there. Anybody who's there is there for uh, a very important reason. You're all in the club. Please don't be shy about walking up and saying hello to anybody. Don't that, be shy. That's for other guests. That's for uh, anybody you perceive is like, oh my gosh, I don't want to bother so and so because of whatever. please yep. bother so and so. Tom exactly. Merritt will be there. Ask him all of your Android questions, but make sure to begin with, I'm poor and have an Android. And I need, yeah, yeah. And my phone is commensurate to my position. Yeah, and, sure. and yeah. so I have. And when these he says, questions. why do you say that? And say, uh, then say, uh, do you uh, know? Do you know Darren Kitchen? Yeah. <laughs> Can you introduce me to Darren Kitchen? Green show bit. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Uh, 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 what what other ground rules? I mean that that was the big one. Is 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 just be friendly and approachable. Come on up. Yeah. And and uh, uh, in general, wear shorts. It's gonna be hot. Yeah. Yeah. It will be hot. It, it will it will be hot. Oh, also uh, we mentioned it in the in the green room, but we should mention it here. If you are in town, either in Austin or in town before the event on Saturday, the unofficial meetup. The unofficial meetup. Uh, at the Crowded Barrel Distillery. Seven names it has it for does. the one they... fucking building. But it is the Fang and Feather Bar adjoined to the Crowded Barrel Distillery at, on the at campus Wizard, of Academy. Wizard Academy. That's right. All of which is four feet near in the Salt Lake. West Austin. Yes. Yes. Uh, uh, but come on out five to eight. Yep. I'll on be Friday. there. Friday, Friday, Friday. Friday. Uh, Heaton will be there. Merritt will be there. You'll be there. Allie will be there. 
Uh, 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 Brett will be there. Thank you. I got the name of the wow. in the goddamn room. I was naming out of town <laughs> people. He starts turning. He's like, chair will be there. Chair, yeah. <laughs> Brett's uh, going to be announced last. We'll be there. Oh, microphone will be there. Television will be there. Uh, no, no, no. Sorry. Uh, 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 Brett's hurt oh. butt will be there last. Yeah. Yeah. Crusty uh, hurt butt. His crusty hurt butt. Crusty hurt uh, butt. Most importantly, go to the Discord. Discord, Discord. The Founders Day Discord is a place where you can talk to people or How do people talk to get chat there? around. Uh, I don't know. Go to Discord. Hey. Go to Discord. Is the Just, Founders yeah, Day you, server. You, you say, say to your Android device, I am poor. Take me to Discord. You say, yeah. Uh, uh, all right. If you bought a ticket, you have access. You probably got an email with the link to that Discord. It is separate from our normal Diamond Club Discord. So sure. Yeah. Go. But I also say if you're in Austin, come on. Up. Also, uh, uh, um, who boy. Uh, uh, I, I think there's one person listening right now who will appreciate this. If you can, don't park here. <laughs> yeah, so, you would you would be doing so many favors if oh, you do not bring four wheels yeah, 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 that yeah, you need for to the store oh, on oh, Saturday. Yeah. Uh, Uber, 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 please. please. Yep. Uber. It yep. would make Uber. so many people in this room happy if you did not. <laughs> Five stars and tips. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker grows an inch, and all of a sudden, uh, patreon.com <laughs> slash great night is oh. where you can go. That's how to we're gonna toss to this. Oh. <laughs> how do you think we <laughs> Uber? I love we Uber because you pay us money for this dumb shit. <laughs> <laughs> Patreon.com slash great night. Up to five <laughs> bonus episodes a month. <laughs> Up to, like, we'll never do more? I mean, no, you're guaranteed up to at five. least four. At least <laughs> If we're doing this again, <laughs> we're doing this again. <laughs> we're doing this yeah, again. It's fine, it's fine. We're doing uh, it no, again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's what you know what would be easy? What? One a week. Uh, seems thing. less than uh, uh, if you're counting numbers what would be highest five four or one mm, i think it would be one okay how about this are, all you, right, all are right. you fucking an idiot i think like, one is the highest price. go that ain't how numbers go what what do you mean five is higher than one no i don't think that that because uh, i learned one first <laughs> <laughs> so it must be more important, That's and right. it's also very lonely. <laughs> like it it's incredible. It the loneliest number. Yeah. That you'll okay. ever know. Look, I, 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 I'm gonna I, rain I, frogs on your <laughs> shit, dude. <laughs> Patreon.com/slash/great night. Hey, uh, not gonna show. lie. This week's uh, bonus episode was particularly good because we went full NPR and we interviewed a chicken. Yes, a chicken. <laughs> it really happened. It really you can really hear him. We going, had random. We had we had uh, a, a random cock. Injection Whoa. into the uh, in, 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 into the show on Thursday, so go get that. <laughs> That's uh, not a chicken sound. You're just moaning into the mic, Brian. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not as tall as Justin. Ah, no, <laughs> that's just his Bobcat Goldweight impression. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hey Bryce, do you have a game for us? I do have a game for us. This is from our friend. Uh, uh, Meryl Barr, uh, uh, who we all know and love. Uh, this is a game that I'm calling Real or Fake. We love Bruce Willis edition. <laughs> we do. We all love Bruce. That's right. Uh, Big shout out to uh, a legend retired uh, uh, not but a week and a half ago mm -hmm. right. after uh, a, a great career. Uh, uh, Brian, what's your favorite Bruce Willis movie? Uh, I mean, oh, oh, oh. What just happened in my brain? I know, right? Die, die Hard, maybe. Uh, well, I mean, that's the most harder. obvious one. But then, the, the, I mean, the Die Hard Sixth Three End? with a Vengeance. And, yeah. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Fifth Element. That, that, that's a, that's a cold hit. Man, Fifth Element. All right, can we yeah. talk about the Fifth Element? Yeah. Let's talk about the Fifth Element. Let's do yeah, because Lee Lou Dallas multipass. Like uh, Gary Oldman is a goddamn superstar. H. Ross Perot is an intergalactic uh, 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 space pirate president with a yep. gun. Uh, fucking great. Uh, uh, all the actors, fucking great. The set design, great. The 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 world, great. Fifth Element is love, motherfucking love. He's European. Motherfucking love. It's Luke Besson. He's European. What are you gonna First do? First time I ever saw Chris Tucker. It was amazing. He blew the the ears off my screen watching. That's the first time you saw Chris Tucker? Come yeah. On, man. It was before Rush Hour. Yeah. But it was after Friday, right? 
I ain't never Ooh. seen Friday. Oh. White people. God damn it. <laughs> Her name is Bravery. Because she was brave. <laughs> White people don't <laughs> see Friday in the theaters. <laughs> So. What's the first question? Do you want me to keep going? Because, <laughs> no. by the way, I, just, I, could, I, 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 I could keep going with that like you could the rap. Like. <laughs> so we, uh, so uh, people know that uh, the past couple years have not been great for Bruce Willis movies. They have not been uh, stellar, let's say. Well, and, no, and, 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 yeah, and by the way, was, for anybody who doesn't covered, know. Yeah, this was yeah. covered in a big Los Angeles Times article that came out around the time that he retired that... Uh, uh, there was a effort from whom we, you know is still like kind of uh, out there people in his orbit to to basically make all the last amount of money that he was going to be able to make right and that was primarily with these lower budget films that were very happy to have him say two lines in a movie and so just they hang out in the background his, so they could put his his face on the cover and sell it internationally right and and and, and kudos to them i mean uh, uh when when uh, so uh uh one of one of what i thought was a ha ha gotcha university classes i took was about linguistics and the brain uh and and uh, there's a couple of different areas there's broca's area and there's uh, an aphasia which is what you've heard in the news and aphasia is like basically picture a circuit board it's like a i don't know a scar a slash across the circuit board a lot of reasons that can happen you could have debris from an exploding something you could have a stroke or or, or a burst aneurysm or whatever uh, uh there's a couple of different types there's uh broca's aphasia where uh if you were to ask me a question i would try to respond it would just go uh, and I, I couldn't make it. Uh, there's uh, understanding aphasias. Uh, so think of reading, writing, and uh, 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 input, output, right? So um, uh, uh, in, uh, I believe it's called Wernicke's aphasia. I, you would say, hey, what would you like for lunch? And I would say, hey, man, I want a uh, half foot long subway with a lot of bell peppers. But, uh, and I would think that's what I'm saying. But what would come out is just, and Susan says, and Susan says, and so on. Uh, and so. Uh, uh, what does Susan say? Uh, well, that's, that's, that's all I would say in this example. Yeah, because yeah. I wouldn't and realize you'd be I'm an saying asshole that. for asking. What a, uh, what uh, mm, 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 yeah, you got me. My mm, asshole joke was successful. Mm, <laughs> uh, so, understandably, the family is being tight lipped about the specifics. And to be honest, it's none of our business. Uh, good on them for recognizing, like, uh, we, got, we got a couple years here. Let's 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 bank. And according to the article, basically, it was just like uh, 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 some number of millions of dollars. Uh, you get two days. Hey, this 25 page script. What say we just uh, down to five pages and you got all day. But wouldn't it be great if we were done by lunch? Uh, yeah. And uh, and 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 God bless him. Uh, uh, Bruce Willis was a trooper and all of the people in his orbit. And we wish them the best. And now let's play a game. To figure out whether or not any number of the, I believe, 22 or 44 different movies he did in the last two years. Uh, he did quite a lot. He did a lot. Are either real or fake. That's right. So I'm going to give you the name of a movie. Looper's my favorite. Uh, I'm going to give you uh, the movie's favorite? name. Over Die Hard? I mean, I like Looper, but mm. come on. <clears throat> we could sit here with graphs and napkins all day. It doesn't matter. Come on. That was a great moment. Yeah. Uh, uh. Ho, 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 I have a machine gun now is also a good moment. What movie is that from? <laughs> from fucking Die Hard. From the, the sandwich. Not familiar. Not familiar with that, huh? Mm. <laughs> Sorry. I'm, Look at this guy. I'm not familiar with my work. <laughs> <laughs> mm, mm, mm. I don't know, man. Let's go to the cinema. Watch a movie, man. Yeah, oh, my God. Are there two Bruce time. Willis's yeah, there? Yeah, these impressions are so good. Yeah, these are two Bruce Willis's. I got to die really hard, <laughs> man. Oh, my God. <laughs> I wonder if the third Bruce Willis is about to show up. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, Allie, man. you have a Bruce Willis? What's going on? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh my God. Oh Three my Bruce God. Willis. Allie, hey. <laughs> no, no, no. Come, come here. On, come on. here. You hey, have to do Allie, you want to play the game? Yeah. Here we go. We're, we're, we're oh, my God. Three Harmony Willis's. on our Bruce Willis's. I can't hey. believe I'm so mad you ruined Fifth Element for me. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, man, that was crazy. Remember when I came back in uh, the other movie that wasn't good? And... Yeah. Yeah, I totally remember that. Probably. It's unbreakable, but then I was in the other movie. You remember it was called, it was about, you know. Yeah. Red, red Notice. Red Notice. That's right. 
Can we? All right, we might as well. Yeah, Allie, would you like to play our game? With Allie Spagnola, can we get you a mic and have you join us for this game? Hey, uh, grab one of the ones off stage. That uh, there. Ladies and gentlemen, there. joining us live on stage, Allie Spagnola. Allie Spagnola. Yeah. Oh, you're going to be great at this. Uh, you know, we were talking beforehand. Here, scoot down, scoot down a little and, bit. Um, we're, we're, we're off center here. And we, uh, we were perfect. discussing whether or not to have an unplanned uh, opportunity to bring you on stage. And Justin was like, I don't know. Does Allie even know a Bruce Willis movie? And I was like, she knows all of them. She, yeah. <laughs> she runs the yes. Bruce Wikia. I'm yeah. not here to make you guys look like you know a whole lot about Bruce Willis. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what do you got, Bryce? All right, so uh, I'm going to give you the name of the movie, the year, and the tagline. In fact, Brett is going to help me with this. Uh, yes, I am. Brett, why don't you take it away with the first round? All right. Fortress 2021. Ex-CIA agent Robert lives in a hidden woodland resort. <laughs> that serves as a retirement community for former spies. His estranged son, Paul, <laughs> is a cryptocurrency go, go. entrepreneur who has run into trouble and needs to ask his old man for help. Unfortunately, Paul's plans aren't as secret as his father's location. I wish the camera was able to both show the question and the moment that simultaneously both Justin and Allie Cross their arms <laughs> in skeptical listening form. So we're going to start with uh, Brian on this one. Is this movie real or fake? I, I'm going to say fake, but not for the right reason. I'm only going to say fake because there is an equally not very good movie called Fortress that I saw in the early 90s that starred uh, Christopher Lambert. And I don't think it was very good. It was and not. there's only so many bad movies that could be made with the name Fortress. Okay, so Brian is going to say. It's a universal law. <laughs> That's right. They, they, they did that in science class. Yep. Brian's going to say fake. Justin, is Fortress real or fake? Real. I think this is exactly the movie you make if you need Bruce Willis to die in the first three scenes. Uh, uh, he's the ex spy. They come in. And he's like, hey, I'm, 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 I'm your son. I have a higher pitch voice. Hey, son, what are you doing? <laughs> hey, man, I just made a bunch of Dogecoin. Uh, 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 but we need, I need you to hide my Doge. Uh, well, son, I hope you didn't tell anybody to... <laughs> Like, oh shit! I, I posted on my Snapchat stories that I was in the secret spy village. And then next thing you know, there the rest. There's the rest of the movie. Bruce Willis is on the poster. Bada bing, bada boom. Some French child is watching this on subtitles. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there we go. All right, Justin, Allie, so real. You Allie, what do you think? I'm gonna go with fake because I think it's too soon for Hollywood to be hip to crypto or Snapchat for that matter. <laughs> Fair point. <laughs> All right, there we go. So uh, Brian has said fake. Justin has said real. Ali has said fake. By the way, thank you to our friend Stephen Cogswell for the uh, the quiz tool that we're using. I'll talk more about it in the after show, but it's called blue. It's called Blue Choose, and it's very cool. Right on. All right. Uh, let's choose. Wait, is, choose. It, is, it, is that a boner pill thing? No, choose. Like, you oh, choose it. Got it. Not okay. Choose. No, that's yeah. good. That's but good. It, <laughs> yeah. But also, <laughs> yes. <laughs> but also, yes. But also, yes. No, no, no. <laughs> but, but this uh, actually makes things more uh, uh, easy. Uh, what, instead of hard. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. I got there right as you were late. You're so tall. <laughs> I'm, I'm, so, I'm so glad that Allie's here too because I look even taller. I was thinking that. I just got here. I missed the beginning, but have you gotten taller? I barely have. <laughs> this is way better than being famous. <laughs> Free show, Ben. <laughs> Do you know who your co-host is? <laughs> no. <laughs> Neither <Anyway>. do I. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to reveal the answer we were looking for. Real. Yay! That's a Justin okay. poem. Yeah. Yeah. Let's watch the entire trailer. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on to our next question. Brett, can you help me with this? You don't even need to. I told you it. <laughs> Once a time in Venice. Uh, once upon a time. Once upon a time in <laughs> Venice. <laughs> 2017. A Los Angeles detective seeks out the ruthless gang that stole his dog. Led by its even more ruthless leader, Spider. Spelled with a Y. <laughs> I'm going to start with you, Justin. Is this real or fake? Fake. Well, once upon a time in Venice. But Justin's gonna say fake. Allie, yeah, you? no, I think I think it's oh. fake, man. Who loses a dog in Venice? 
<laughs> the spider. <laughs> Who wrote these? It sounds like something that came from your Discord. I'm going to say fake. <laughs> okay, Ali's going to say fake. I believe our friend Meryl Barr wrote all of these. Uh, uh, real and fake. 2017 is a long time ago. Yeah. Um, I don't... It was clearly a reaction to Trump. <laughs> uh, the dog is... The dog Decency. is democracy. Yeah, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say fake. I'm gonna say fake. I'm gonna spider say fake. is fake, Kelly fake, and fake, Conway. Fake, fake, fake. fake. <laughs> remember Kelly and Conway? <laughs> yeah, remember, 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 remember. All right, everyone has said fake. The answer we were looking for is real. Fuck you show the trailer. All right, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are these descriptions and Meryl's in the chat? Are these descriptions Meryl? Right, what they are, or the actual descriptions of the movie? Uh, very good question. The little bit that I looked, uh, I believe he wrote. Yeah, he wrote both That's fair real enough. and fake ones. Uh, so, th so that is so, like so. There is no consistency. Well, yes, there's consistency. Consistent that he that wrote some are real, all some bullshit, are fake, no, no, but no. they've all been written by Meryl. Barr. They've all been bullshitized yeah. by they've, Meryl Barr. They've all been Barr. summarized yeah. by Meryl Barr. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. So okay. Yeah, he wrote a slightly longer description than the taglines that are available. Oh, so the, the real ones were pulled from IMDb. Right. No. 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 Wait, no, no. Hold on. This is not. No. 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 So no, that no. wasn't pulled from IMDb. I oh, know. Shit. That's what no, I'm it fucking telling you. It's telling you. He no. Broke. Sorry. I'm reading Meryl in the chat. <laughs> okay. All right. Look. Oh I, I, uh, Leonardo DiCaprio. Yes. You recognize the thing on the television. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I I didn't edit any of these at all. I copied pasted them from his email. So uh, okay. He, all right. He did some editing, I think. But uh, okay. So no, there we none go. None of my questions have been answered. I don't know what your question was. My question is: Are these all? Like just through the Merrill filter, or were they copied well, from an official? In, in this case, I think they uh, are through the Merrill filter. I think if he they're wrote all through the Merrill filter, then that's all I need. To I know. mean, again, okay. the first sentence was directly from IMDb, so uh, the one that we just did was a hybrid. It, he uh, added another. He sentence. added. Sentence? He yes. added things. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so he's, yeah, okay. He's dirtying things up. To okay, hide them. okay. Yeah, man, it's one of our games, dog. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. But this is the point: is that I'm trying to suss out his pattern. I'm sniffing them mm, among us. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, so the score currently is Brian has got uh, zero. Justin's got one. Alan, Ali, not Alan. Sorry. <laughs> Ali has got zero. Big, it's big, big, big Alan. Alan. Big Al. <laughs> big Al. All right. We're going to go on to the next question. If you can help me out with this, Brett. Playdate 2016. Womanizer Paul Trainer is asked to watch his sister's children for a week while their single mother goes out of town for a conference. While the brother and sister duo bring chaos, they may also bring the key to Paul's love life as single mothers begin a, to take a liking to him as he is seen around the town with the children. Here we go. Allie, we're going to start with you on this one. Oh, man. Play date, real or fake? Oh, so much action in this one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say fake because it's just not, not manly enough for him. Oh, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I think if I were to say it's real, it's because he plays the, the father yeah. of the kids that like now the, the the guy is like bringing him around and then all of a sudden there's this awkward moment that's very Bruce Willis where they're like at he's the, the park man. and he's like, like oh hey uh, uh, balloon and uh, uh, lyric uh, uh, that, those are my TV kids and microphone uh, 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 and, and then and, and the main character is like <laughs> and the main character is like, like, like hey who are you and he's like I'm the father and then uh, he's like, oh, sorry, sir. And, and then he's like, hey, hey, here, balloon, here's 10, 10 Dogecoin. Go buy yourself a churro. Oh, wow. Uh, 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 and then he's like, let me tell you something about uh, uh, being a single man. I regret it. You should fall in love as fast as possible. That's my time, y'all. And then his handlers like took him off set. <laughs> So I'm going to say this is real because now I actually really want to see this movie. <laughs> Justin's going to call it real. Uh, for, for the record, I already thought it was real, but now I really think it's real. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Brian and Justin have said real. Ali said oh. fake. We were looking for. F -f 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 
Allie's on the board. Now we have to go make it. Kickstarter <laughs> right now. Featuring balloon hey, and Bruce, lyric. Hey, Bruce, one more movie. <laughs> I've got the perfect pitch. You son of a bitch, I'm in. <laughs> All right, here's our next round, Brett, if you don't mind. Bygone Trail 2019. A man on the run in 1853 New Mexico finds himself caught between warring Native American tribes and a land developer trying to install newly developed railroad tracks for a pass to California during the uh, the 1800s (laughs) gold rush. Mm. Facts check out. That was a long sentence. Who goes first? We're going to start with Brian on this one. Real, because everybody knows that those were newly invented technology of rails. So you think the historical accuracy <laughs> oh, on, of the fact that. is the reason why on parallel. Yeah. Do you know fact check? Do you know that several universities, including dog universities, <laughs> had to update their syllabus after this movie came out? It was so astonishingly accurate. <laughs> As quoted uh, about their uh, uh, embarrassing admission, uh, a dog university said, Woof. <laughs> All right. Uh, Allie, what do you think? Their college song. Fuck is- you. You are. I'll tell you what, Bryce. Bryce? Yeah. You're dogging me. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think he's very brave. Bravery. Mm. Uh, fuck you. Fuck you. This is my house. Boo. <laughs> Uh, wait, who's next? Is uh, it Allie or me? Yeah. Justin is next. Bygone trail. What? Wait, didn't you just... You, wait, no, no, you threw to her, but that doesn't mean that it's well, actually... Well, we've yeah. gone in this order the entire game up it's until Bryce's now. It's Bryce's call. I don't know. He's okay. supposed to be keeping track. Yeah, it's Justin's turn. Justin went out of order last round. It is Justin's <laughs> turn. Oh, sorry. <laughs> La bygone trail. My bad, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> uh, bygone trail. Bygone trail. Who do you think is it, this is my thing here? Who who does Bruce Willis play in in this movie? <laughs> yeah, what's weird? Yeah, what's weird? Out of, out of all, oh my god! <laughs> one of the Native Americans. And, and I, I, you know what? Now that you're saying it, it rings a bell. Uh, I have a hard time remembering how he sounded in the role. Oh, though. Jiminy! Wow! Criminy. I can't wait for this to get clear later. <laughs> how uh, I'm Bruce Willis. <laughs> <laughs> I see you, you need to do it. Hey, hey, hey. Sorry, Al. it's been a while. You actually don't need to walk into those holes anymore. Sorry. Hey, uh, me and my people have been on this land for a long time. We don't want your railroad, white man. Is that some of the bison you're leaving to waste? Don't do that. Yeah, that tracks. Yeah, it's uh, Justin. Fake, 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 fake. fake. Justin's going to say it's fake. Allie, what do you think about Bygone Trail? I think this is real. It's the precise amount of woke that Hollywood would be into. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like, you want to know what? We, we really want to respect Native Americans mm. and the railroad. And <laughs> make money on it. And, oh. But mostly, we could equally respect them and make money. Great Saturday. Can we get uh. roast? <laughs> Strangely enough, shot in China. I, of who, course. It's yeah. cheaper. It's cheaper. Rod Stewart soundtrack. Cut print. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Brian and Bygone I. Bygone Railroad. <laughs> Sorry. It's a bygone trail. Uh, Brian... Bygone Trail. <laughs> That's the second part. <laughs> oh, it's a call, <laughs> it's a call <laughs> and response. Railroad Sorry, is after they, they, they steamroll over like a mirth train. <laughs> they do yeah. steamroll over it. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Call it joy. Brian and Ali said real. Justin has said fake. We were looking for... Hey, God damn it! Hey, 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 hey. That's gonna bring. You tell me, history ain't real no more. When I when I was a kid, they used to teach history, and it was facts. <laughs> Next question. Wow. Oh. Okay. okay. Look at look at look at Mister Anti CRT over here. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean by that? <laughs> Is that Christian Bale? Uh, pray to me. <laughs> oh, no. That's CRT. Christian replacement <laughs> okay. theory. All right. All right. <laughs> all right. Let's go to our next round. Brett, if you don't mind. Midnight in the switchgrass. Mm-hmm. An FBI agent and his partner are close to busting a sex trafficking <laughs> ring when they team up with a Florida law enforcement agent as they realize their investigation has crossed paths with a brutal serial Killer. Oh, a brutal serial killer. All right, we're going to start with Justin on this Oh, one. a brutal? They have them in brutal now. 
Yeah. I so mean, Bruce Willis serial, has to be. There's serial killers, and then there's brutal serial kill, killers. Bruce has to be the Florida FBI agent here, because I'm only thinking of roles that take two days to shoot. Yeah. Yeah. It's probably pretty smart. <laughs> so yeah, they come down, and he's like, "Hey." Hey, hey, hey. Did, did you uh, just feed him his line? Yeah. Yeah. Did, uh, too close. <laughs> oh. This is a respectful game that we're, we're doing. Respectable. Today. We're remembering a great actor. <laughs> hey, sorry, I'm finishing my Cuban sandwich. <laughs> He's in Florida. He's in Florida, of course. Yeah, don't worry, it's on Uncle Sam's tab. Federal agent. <laughs> Anyway, uh, the serial killers <laughs> down in Coral Gables. Yeah, but uh, I'll, I'll see you at the highlight track. <laughs> <laughs> it's Florida. Uh, yeah, that shit's real as fuck. Uh, yeah, I think it's real. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, uh, Allie, what do you think? I'm gonna go with fake. I can't picture that title on a movie poster. Midnight in the Switchgrass. Really? Yes. No. That seems like a very movie postery title. Uh, actually, I'm with Ali. I think that it no, would... no, I mean, I, I I would say you're right in that it's uh not a title that would be on a direct to like you know foreign kind of movie because those are like smash like <laughs> ladies titties or something like what uh, that, like I, 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 like midnight in the switchgrass is like you're going for Oscar bait. It's like oh, yeah. like Will Smith. But sorry. Oh, uh, 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 <laughs> It would be uh, 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 fucking yeah, apologizing. I said, <laughs> I said, his name. he's not in the academy anymore. Uh, sorry, sorry. I don't know who I'm about. I'm apologizing to him that I don't get. Sorry, slapped. sorry, sorry. Is is your thesis that Midnight in the Switchgrass is too good a title it's, for it, the level? It's ponderous. Of yeah, no, yeah. it's terrible. Like sell this movie. It's like a, it's like a, a, a two a.m. in the weeds. I mean, it's a, it's a bad title. No, it's a bad that's title a tension movie. movie. Midnight in the Switchgrass is like a Clint Eastwood movie <laughs> that he would make. Afternoon in the Moonlight. That's oh, no. That's Wes Anderson. That's, that's a Wes good Anderson. Name. Yeah. Yeah. Or, no, no, no. Who's the, the, the fucking... Uh, uh, Quentin Ethan Tarantino. Hawk, Julie Depley, Midnight James after Midnight. James Cameron. Fucking indie people. George know, Lucas. I'm talking about. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> fucking heathens. Link, Jesus Linklater. Christ. <laughs> Linklater. Is it, no, was it Linklater? Michael Bay. Yeah, that's what the audience Michael is telling Bay, you. Michael Bay, that's who it is. Yeah, it was Linklater. The, it, it, yeah, what are you saying? <laughs> Isn't he from Austin? <laughs> Linklater, you should yeah, know Linklater. Yeah, yeah I know. You know everybody. I just moved here five minutes ago. I know that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Afternoon a year since with you've been there, huh? Anyway, I'm changing my answer. It's fake. <laughs> so Justin's going to change his answer to fake, sure. It doesn't matter. Okay. All right. The answer we were looking for for Midnight in the Switchgrass. Real! Well, I fucked myself on that one, didn't I? Kind of yeah. fucked yourself on that I, one. I, I think I got a point I didn't deserve because I thought I said it was fake. But, uh, I'll take it. <laughs> Do you, I, I mean, I can. No, I'm, I'm taking the point. Taking okay. the point. Okay, there we go. Uh, Price's rulings are final. That's, that's right. right. It's You could have been completely gotten away with it. Absolutely. Oh. All right, <laughs> Brett, if you don't mind our next If it weren't for these meddling, <laughs> listening Bryces. <laughs> Son of a gun, they just canceled Moon Knight. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. By the way, Brian, save six hours of my fucking life. Welcome to being on the board. <laughs> so. On the board, yeah, yeah. Hey. Hey. You're That's like right. Elon Musk. Yes. Topical. Topical. Topical references. Brett, please. Eight. I like that everybody <laughs> just yelled topical and nobody laughed. It was just I wonder a press why. release. I was just putting out a market watch press release that Elon Musk joined the board of Twitter. <laughs> when everybody solemnly nodded in recognition, not a titter. Indeed. What an unfunny <laughs> piece of shit I am. No wonder I'm not recognized by either the Google Fiber salesman or the random patron in a backspin. Dear Diary. <laughs> I'm sorry, Justin. 
Oh my god! And now, now all I want to see is like the nightly news, and then uh, it's just they deliver the news straight. But there's like a sidekick. He goes topical, topical. Wow. Like, oh. wow! Everybody's talking about that today, huh? Yeah. <laughs> is the internet on? You know, the thing about that story is I heard about it. Yeah. <laughs> I've used a story before. Me too. Now we got something in common. Brett, please read Apex for me. Apex. <laughs> Former policeman James Malone. Ooh. Serving a life sentence for a crime he did not commit. Well, that's a twist. Is given a chance to regain freedom if he survives a deadly game in which a group of hunters pays for the pleasure of hunting another human. What the? On a remote island. They definitely made me read this script in grade school. Yeah. <laughs> in yeah. Grade I mean, school. They had a different name at the time. Yeah. But yeah. The name has escaped me because I learned nothing in grade school, but I definitely read about hunting humans for something. Yeah. Mm. And well, they I never mean, did it again. Dead, deadliest game. Is that it? Yeah. Well, the world's. Yeah. yeah. The world's yes. Yeah. You got it. Uh, I think, uh, excuse me, Your Honor. Oh. This is a totally different intellectual uh, property. Yeah. You'll notice that the title here says Apex. Look at the poster, <laughs> asshole. Yeah. What's that a poster of? Is it a human on the run getting shot? No, it's a mm. fucking island. Mm. So I'd appreciate it if you <laughs> shut the fuck up with your highfalutin dog college bullshit and bought this. It's for sale. We got Bruce Willis. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, wait you're a what? salesman? I He's thought you were a IP lawyer. I'm his agent. Suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I think you were appealing to a judge at a certain point. I mean, uh, are you going to buy it or no? <laughs> 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 because I got a two o'clock here. <laughs> <laughs> Allie, we're going to start with you. Do you think Apex is a real I or thought it was the world's <laughs> fastest game. <laughs> Reference to my last character where I said to go to the highlight track. That's in the script for the movie? Deep cut for only 11 people that grew up in Broward County. <laughs> Allie. I think it's real. I, th I oh, yeah. think it's a nice rehashing of a former story that Hollywood there, yeah, excuse to. me injunction oh, <laughs> it's a complete are, are you an agent or, or a lawyer also if you just want to buy it just say so all right you don't got to be trash talking my uh, project uh, sorry, uh, uh, objection uh, can, <laughs> uh bidding war all right no, no, you uh, 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 all right, two million at one dollar sold. Objection to you. Uh, uh, please force the uh, uh, improvers to do more scene work so we know where things are. Okay, look, I got to level with you guys. This ain't a spaceship. <laughs> oh no! Oh, no! no! Stop doing up the scenery. Stop. So Too many sweeping. places where the push room guy can be. It doesn't bring us closer All to the right. reality. It's also not under the sea. Gotcha. We're in a bank. Just give me the $2 million. Call it even. I'm a teller? <laughs> Uh, you gonna then snitch? why am I talking? All right. All right. Loser. 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 Should have been a spaceship. <laughs> So, All right, so we're Brian. Yeah. Do you believe yeah. Apex is a real or fake? I film? think this is real. Brian's gonna say it's real. Justin, what do you think? <sighs> you are leading, by the way, with two points. You're our leader. Uh, fake. Justin's gonna say. One fake. might say we fake. all. No, 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 no. Because I think it's overwritten in that Meryl would know <laughs> that everybody knows that that's obviously. Some bullshit, and so he this, made uh, some uh, obvious uh, uh, bullshit. Time out, real quick, Meryl. This is how you know that you occupy a very special place in Justin's brain. That just your name attached to the game has caused him to short circuit all of his comedy instincts to make sure <laughs> he fucking defeats you. He's not. I mean, we're on stage. I did enough improv for this question. Okay, like... that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> Your Honor, that's an admission of guilt. He goes to Apex what? Island. Two million dollars. Uh, uh, cocoon. <laughs> cocoon. Okay. <laughs> All right, we've got everybody's answers. Brian and Allie say Apex is real. Justin says it's we fake. Die. Yep. The answer that we were looking for is real. Yeah! That's another Brian and Allie point. Brett, what is our score going into our final round? Ladies and gentlemen, we're all tied up. Whoa. Two, Wait, two, two. Re re real. This is a setup. Huh? Oh, I thought you were describing another Bruce Willis movie. Yes, we're all tied up. <laughs> yeah. 
But we have to escape. He's a magician in it. From Switch Bread Island. Shit. Oh, my God. Lisa, I just got back from the children's birthday party, and now I'm all tied up. Well, holy <laughs> shit. Uh, uh, well, uh, did Balloon a- have a good time? <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> the kids, Balloon and, and Lyric, they were great. I love them with all my heart. Uh, uh, a- Bravery a is not too award light of a name. Bruce Willis. <laughs> I'm sorry, I stepped on your shit. That's fine. Dumb that, thing. No, no, no. Fuck me. God damn it. Eject me from the spaceship. You're, You're too tall. tall. You're too tall. Uh, You're originally, too tall now. <laughs> originally, this. I, I, the fucking air is just too thin. I just can't even. <laughs> I can't breathe. Why can't I breathe? I'm just too fucking tall now. <laughs> Why did I wear these shoes? Uh, I have these tall shoes. All right, look, Justin. We, I, didn't want I to got make... these vans with. Goldfish in the heels. <laughs> uh, Justin, look, I think I just wanted to be a pimp. You <laughs> wanted to pimp things, you, you know, mostly cars <laughs> that people could fuck. <laughs> what? I oh, wanted yeah, to no, pimp, pimp fuckable yeah, okay. cars. Um, I'm making up for the improv I didn't do. On no, the last this, question. It, it's, it's fine. It's, uh, <laughs> uh, look, you know that we all look up to you. Yeah. Well, now I don't. <laughs> I don't want that though. <laughs> and now Allie's we, making we would the never small look down sign, you. <laughs> like that. That I I, look I'm up a you little slightly smaller more now. Then, yeah, more. yeah. <laughs> Wait, what a way to misinterpret that is. She meant like just a little bit taller, but instead, yeah, like, like from your read, it's like, and you have a small hey. dick. Oh, hey, all right. Yeah, I thought that was subtext. <laughs> I thought it was subtext. But you have to spell it out. Okay. <clears throat> Bryce? S M A L L L S M A L L Fuck you. God Microphone, it, television. All right, hello, everybody. We got our final round. Final, final round. Final round. And this one is worth two to ten points. Holy Oops. Cow. So it's still anybody's game. And it's all tied up anyway. So there we go. Uh, Brett, if you wouldn't mind reading our final question. Sliced and diced. 2020. Oh, my God. Retired. Four star chef Joe Porch. Joe Porch. And his staff find themselves trapped by a sadistic killer in a newly renovated remote bed and breakfast <laughs> and must survive the night or face death by sunrise. <laughs> Wait, are, are they vampires? Death by sunrise? Uh, never mind. Joe Porch, that's the name. <laughs> uh, 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 Bryce, can you bring that full screen again so I can just uh, mm-hmm. give it, give a gander on it? Uh, uh, this is uh, our final round. This is worth ten points. Uh, we are going to start with Brian on this one when you're ready. Oh dear. Yeah. Who do you I think, think Bruce fake? is? I, well, think? I, I, I mean, first of all, who he is is uh, uh, tired chef Joe Porch. No, you don't think so. No, 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 no. no, no His no, knife. No. Uh, wait. Actually, He's the staff. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, the staff are I the mean, stars. Okay, I, now I'm fascinated by this question. Let's say Joe Porch, the role's already been filled. <laughs> Where would you put... Hi, great news. Your story about Joe Porch and his <sighs> bed and breakfast... God, it, was, we it got came from, Bruce it came from my, my childhood. I'm just so glad. <laughs> like, like, It's every screenwriter's dream to have his vision like born out. Thank God. Right? Uh, uh, so, uh, good news. You got Bruce Willis. Bad news, <sighs> he can't take... The role of Joe Porch. No. So who do you want him to play? Well, I mean, <laughs> there's uh, Doug. <laughs> we got who, we got we got nosy neighbor through the sewer at the end. We've got and then the ghost of the house. Uh, and the, yep, <laughs> that's the thing I wrote into my script. <laughs> I'm glad you've read it. Uh, the ghost of the house who uh, just shows up like a Greek chorus and repeats what's happening so the audience knows and just uh, uh, when somebody gets stabbed just goes, hey, that guy just got stabbed. I'm a house. I can't affect any outcome, but holy shit. Yo, that man got stabbed. Hey, I need you to change my filter sometime, man. Yeah, by the way, it's been three years. Come on, man. You got to do it every year. six months. What the fuck? This HVAC is in a real bad way. We got some peeling in the back bathroom, man. Come on. Hey, can you wash my windows? Hey, man, wash my windows, dog. And I'm just telling you, the roof is hanging on by a thread. We're back. We're back to three Bruce Willis. I'm very happy. (laughs) (laughs) All right, Brian, we're starting with you on this one. Sliced and diced. I think it is fake, and I'm sad that it's fake. 
Brian is going to say fake. Justin. Real as rain, Bryce. Ooh. Real as rain, he says. Ooh. All right. Allie. Yeah, I think it's real. It seems so fake that you probably built this whole game around that. The fact that this was a dog shit movie yeah, that he did that has to be real. Yeah. All right. There we go. Justin and Allie have said real. And Brian has said fake. For 10 points in the game. We were looking for fake. Brian is your winner. It took, took me a second to process that I'd won. <laughs> I was just like, is that good or bad? I was busy Welcome thinking. to the party, pal. <laughs> Uh, thank you very much to Meryl Barr for yes, sending this thank in. You, yes, thank you, Meryl. Uh, and uh, many, many shouts outs to Stephen Cogswell for the thing. I'll talk about it in the after show because it's a whole thing and I want to give it a lot of time. But thank you, Stephen Cogswell, as well. If you've got an idea for a game, a question, email, anything, please send it into our email address, greatnightpod at gmail.com. Thank you. Oh, hells yes. Justin, we've talked about doing this segment since this show ever began. Do you yep. remember the first thing I said to you? Hey, one time we're going to make a, a, a show and then one day we're going to interview Ali Spagnola in a way that doesn't burn our entire relationship with our former network. <laughs> ah, ah. Word for word. <laughs> word for word. And so that's why she's here live in person. Yeah. Where she can never Woo! deny having been here. Ali Spagnola. Hello. Uh, Thanks for so, having me. Uh, Ali, we've been fans of, of your work for a very long time. I feel like we were early adopters. Uh, and, um, man, it has been an absolute blast to see you become only more and more popular. Uh, most recently, I noticed on Reddit. Uh, 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 Holy uh, shit. Yeah. No, your oh, you, 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 you see you're, you're, you're see-through car shit yeah. blew up. <laughs> I was stoked about that. And actually, the first time I heard about it was you texting me being like, hey. <laughs> Uh, uh, front uh, uh, you know what? If I may, uh, I would like to quote you verbatim. Uh, <clears throat> this is a, this is a this is a great Brian bit. Brian reads personal text. Uh, yeah, basically, uh, you you gave a sentiment. Uh, but, uh, hold on, hold on. As as Brian looks this up, explain the see through car thing for folks who are only hearing this on podcast. Oh yeah, okay. So I wanted to do something stupid for April Fool's Day. That's Christine, and she's very. Straight laced person, unlike myself, as you can tell by this getup. And she does not want attention. And I took her car and I made it see through via a ridiculous car wrap. And so now it looks like, yeah, she's in this outfit in the car with a rubber chicken <laughs> when she's driving around. It's still wrapped like that. She's like, I got to take that to work. Wait, I, I, so, 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 yeah. So, in the same way that people would wrap a car with like an advertisement, instead, yeah. you made it look like as if there was an x ray. And, and, you and can the see shit, the, the, yeah, there, there are. Yeah. Oh, right. Oh, there's a dog in the back. <laughs> like, so, yeah, so it looks like she's sitting there. It looks like there's somebody in the back of the trunk. It looks like I'm in the trunk, yeah. Yeah. Uh, 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 there's a rubber chicken there. It looks amazing. It is photorealistic. It is great. Uh, the, uh, the, the Reddit thread that blew up, I think, said wholesome April Fool's prank that I thought was really great. And the part that made me very happy was all of the comments were like, uh, explain, you know, uh, explaining to each other, her name's Ali Spagnola, and she's big on uh, <laughs> platform. You know, they, they said five different, <laughs> different platforms, which yes. was pretty great. Uh, and then uh, and I said, hey, you're on Reddit. That's great. And she goes, yeah, that's usually where they scrape your shit and you make no money. And most people badmouth <laughs> yeah. you. And I'm like, not today. <laughs> today they're scraping your shit and praising you. Yay! Yay! <laughs> uh, so so uh, what, what has been of everything you've done for how long now? What, 8, 10, 12 years? It's been a minute. Yeah. Uh, this, is, is there a particular favorite bit that took off that you were most proud of? Yes. Ooh. The one that we're doing tomorrow. Oh, shoot. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's a, that, that's, this, this is a pro right here. Ooh. P.T. Spagnola over here. <laughs> yeah. should, we, should we tease this? Uh, sure, yeah. Because uh, if uh, it falls through, that's fine. I, we'll just have, this will be commemorating okay, what okay, happened. Okay, so conversation goes like this. Hey, would you like to come out to Founders Day? Yes. Dot, dot, dot. Anyway, I'm going to break a Guinness World Record at your events. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, on the day of or slightly before? She's like, whatever. <laughs> and it's like, what's the record? The world's largest cotton candy sculpture. Ooh. Now, I don't want to start beef. 
It's a bold move to come to Bonnie Brushwood's backyard, make the world's largest sculpture. <laughs> oh, right. Oops. Yeah. We'll have an art off. Oh, yeah. no. Maybe, <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe uh, uh, note to self, invite Bonnie. Yep. Yeah. yeah. We'll yeah. need some more hands. Uh, note to self, buy a bigger kiln. <laughs> <laughs> but one big enough to cremate my roommates. So there's a reason, Jesus. as a musician, I am not here oh, with my fun. instrument, because you... Oh, because my wife is going to kill me. Well, no, we got that. Yeah, yeah. But that's... that's, that's Was that not morose. worth a what the fuck? Well, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we have some self-esteem. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, I'm not nervous about Founders Day. You're nervous about Founders Day. Allie, what's your, uh, <laughs> what, what, what's your, what's your record? I mean, do we want to unpack this now? Yes, yes, yes. Go ahead. <laughs> So, so you are you are building the world's largest cotton candy sculpture? Yes. So we we chatted a little bit about the mass that goes into it, mm -hmm. but uh, have you calculated the volume? How tall are we talking? Oh, I don't. Well, what does one thousand servings of cotton candy look like? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, that like if if all the kids at the fair threw up at once. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, Google tells me that one ounce of cotton candy is a serving. Yeah. So that would be 1,000. So 1,000 so answers. Thousand answer. uh, oh, dear. Uh -oh. oh, dear. Holy shit. Hold she's on. Gonna, she's gonna Wait a minute. Holy oh shit. Oh, my God. God damn it. She's a fucking prop of comic. Of course. Of course she's this was a carry-on. She's got her... her... It's... Oh, my oh God. My God. It's in... oh. oh, no. Oh, this year. Holy shit. Right, so, no, no. So, year. literally, she, she has shown up here to Austin... She did not bring her guitar. <laughs> she did not bring her piano. Yeah. She uh, uh, only had room oh, wow. for a gigantic. How did you get that? Cotton candy uh, sugar. Out of and, cotton and, candy. And also um, uh, asking for a friend. Exactly what TSA uh, did you go through? <laughs> 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 I'll tell you why they let me through. I can show this without showing any of my identifying things. Yeah. It's because. My ID is so charming. Yes, which, uh, uh, by the way, you gave you gave a shouts out on on that uh, for having a wacky photo on your ID. Absolutely, it's uh, it's because Brian Brushwood taught me to have a goofy looking ID, yep. so that I can get away with anything. Uh, it works. Uh, 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 okay, uh, can 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 you can you show it? I think we're we're yeah, good to yeah, zoom yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, will, he will zoom Just, in. Just uh, cover it with your credit card. Yeah, that's, 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 that's <laughs> <laughs> and your mother's maiden name. Oh. Credentials for if anybody needs to get married, I can. Got it? Yeah. Of course. Sweet. Yeah. Wait, did you, you don't get to see the picture. Oh, by the way, do you have answers that I don't have to right, hold right, all this right. fucking sugar on my shoulder? Yeah. Uh, can you show the other camera? Oh. Uh, there we there go. We go. Oh, yeah. oh, that's a goofy photo. Oh, that's a goofy photo. Uh, you you have a um, yeah. uh, YouTube bow tie suspender and glasses, but you, in the video, pointed out that you're not allowed to have glasses with uh, <laughs> with lenses in it, so right. you, you popped out the lenses. Uh, and I got away with it. The guy tried to stop me. And also, I was in full character, obviously, so I'm arguing with this guy about how they're non-glare lenses and he needs to let me get the photo. <laughs> Which it worked. <laughs> and there was pushback? Oh, yeah. He was not happy about it, but somehow it's on my ID now. <laughs> uh, okay. That's and amazing. It, and so so uh, uh, for those of you who, who, who do not know, and I only know this because when I was doing the card games, I would have to take decks of cards, which bricks of organic material, which cardboard is, looks identical to C4 when, oh, really? yes, right. when, when, when they do their scans on it, I would imagine that sugar looks similar to that. It, it looks maybe more like bags of fertilizer than C4, but still horrifying things that could, uh, uh, like the literal reason why TSA exists is to catch that scan. So you get that, they pull it out, and now they're looking at it. What happened? Absolutely nothing. The guy goes, what is in here? And I said, powdered sugar, sir. And he was like, right this way, ma'am. Oh. <laughs> God damn. This, uh, uh, happy days are here again. <laughs> I have applied it and out of love LA. <laughs> we love it. <laughs> oh, uh, okay. All right. Look, I feel like uh, uh, we landed it. Uh, we did it. Uh, uh, Brett, what did we learn? Well, we learned that uh, we're all part of the Nutra, uh, Nutra Sweet Hill gang. God damn it. Yes. <laughs> uh, also, Ali Spagnola. A L I Spagnola everywhere. Yes. Okay. Yep.
<laughs> We've learned that uh, who let the dogs out? Justin let the dogs out. Oh, I asked you know, he, I think it was Justin. He, he, he was the inquisitor on that. I, I think Justin did that. And uh, we journalist. <laughs> That Allie's got a great picture on her website. Allie <laughs> yes. All right, that's it. Uh, Allie Spagnola, do you have one wish that you want to give the world right now? Uh, I wish everyone would respect me as MC Bravery from now on. <laughs> <laughs> my white weapon. Still a great night. Uh, hey, uh, shine on, you crazy diamonds. <laughs> we love you guys. Great right, Founders Day. Founders Week. Oh. Woo! <laughs> You keep me alive. My God. You help me survive. <laughs> no, there's never been oh, yeah. a greater oh, no, no, no. night, a single oh, it's great. It's great. night, a great night, night, a pause the masturbation night, a let's get drunk and laugh tonight. There's never been a greater, greater night. Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs>